how do Taurus and Sagittarius get along? Because Sagittarius, like we said, is that really fiery energy, but then Taurus is seems to be strong, but more earthy, more grounded. How does that flow? Uh, completely well said. Taurus is a very earthy, it is an earth sign, uh, but it's a very sensual sign, ruled by Venus. Uh, so Taurus has the capacity to be very tender and warm and very romantic. Um, and that can be very interesting uh, initially to Sagittarius. Um, so relationships could, um, there could be definitely an attraction there uh, on, an er on an early stage. Um, as these two get to know one another, um, here are two divergent natures. Um, the need for security, which is there to some extent in all earth signs, is clearly there in Taurus. Taurus tends to need to possess, um, likes home, likes creature comforts. Um, Sagittarius loves to roam, loves to adventure, uh, loves the outdoors. and. Um, so that need for adventure and the need for freedom as opposed to the need for security, trust, and to some degree to the loyalty mm -hmm. uh, needs of a Torian may make it difficult in the long haul. Gotcha. So Sagittarius might not be grounded enough to give Taurus that security that it would need to feel comfortable That's well said. in a relationship. Okay. That's well said. And again, like we discussed in the videos for Scorpio and their compatibility, it's not all dependent on just the sun sign. Like we're discussing the sun sign aspect of compatibility, but there are other things to factor in. That's exactly right. Um, we're going to talk about sun signs uh, because we're making this broad mm -hmm. and as simple to understand as possible. But while we're talking about Sagittarian sun sign, uh, someone with a strong Sagittarian focus in their chart um, may find, uh, even though their sun may be in another uh, sign, they may find that a lot of this relates, particularly if they have a Sagittarian moon, Sagittarius on the ascendant. Um, Mars or Venus involved with Sagittarius or the um, uh, houses ruled uh, natally by Sagittarius. So let's see if I, I, I've named um, Sun, Moon, Ascendant, which is rising sign, mm -hmm. uh, Venus and Mars, all those are uh, very much involved with uh, making making romantic and relationship and, and potentially commitment kinds of love relationships. Gotcha. So sun being our essence, who we are and what we came here to express uh, as fully as possible, we're going to focus on the sun signs. Gotcha. So just know essentially that this isn't the be all end all compatibility. There are other factors. And especially in comparing your chart with the chart of someone that you are in relationship with. Gotcha. Those are the luminaries, sun and moon, uh, the points, ascendant, and the planets, especially Venus and Mars, that we most we first look to. Gotcha. All right. Well, there you have it. So hopefully you enjoyed your compa Sagittarian compatibility, and I guess we'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Thank you, thank you, and that's... Once again, we've wrapped it up again. Yeah, cool. I'm glad we got that. <laughs> Good luck, <laughs> <Done. and> love. <laughs>
I know, good luck and love. <laughs> and I don't care who you are, good luck and love. <laughs>